Captain Treacherous Trainer Tony Alanya, he's got two for one in here. Also sending out the eight ship shape. The undefeated blank canvas from post two. Deep field for the Dream Maker. They're off and pacing. First to fire down the center is best in show. Best in show right to the front here for Philion. Ship shape on the outside. There's Captain Ahab up close early from in third. Speed outside from Captain Nash into fourth as he will look for some racetrack in the early going. Back there from in fifth tracks along Twin BJs. Then racing up in sixth now, that is blank canvas. Further back to be along seventh is Luciana. And the final three in the group are Max Power, followed by Tiger Hanover. And the last one away is Dance and Lou, the opening quarter in 27 flat. Filling onto the front as he has put best in show on the motor. Filling on his expecting company. He's got Brett Miller all over his back in the pocket spot with ship shape. And he's got Paul McDonnell ranging up with Captain Ahab. Captain Ahab up to clear. Captain Ahab takes the front now. Back into second to best in show. Sitting along from in third. There at the inside is ship shape. He is right there third inside. Tracking along from in fourth is Captain Nash. They all get over top of one another through a 55 and one half. They're rolling right along though. They're still all over top of each other on the way to the far turn. And it's Captain Ahab on the lead, but here comes Blank Canvas blasting up alongside. And Blank Canvas has got a neck up in front of Captain Ahab, who's right there at the rail going with him here, toe-to-toe -to, -toe to three quarters. On cover to the outside from in third is Max Power. Then in fourth is Bastion Show. Three quarters up in 123, three-fifths. They're into the stretch. Captain Ahab. Second on the outside, Blank Canvas. Pocket sitting third is Bastion Show. Deep stretch lead. Captain Ahab is still there. He's two lengths in front. Back in second and best in show and all he can do is watch Captain Ahab draw clear. Captain Ahab in deep stretch on top now by five and it's all Captain Ahab. Captain Ahab to score in the Dream Maker. He won impressively by four lengths over best in show then finishing third Captain Nash the mile 151 and one. All right, guys, looking right here, looking here. We'll grab a headshot coming up front. Dream Maker final goes to Captain Ahab, the sensational son of Captain Treacherous, who remains undefeated through four starts. And uh, I've got a couple of the winning team here. We've got Paul McDonnell and Tony Alanya. We'll talk to you, Tony, in just a few moments. Paul, I mean, as Kenny mentioned, going to the gate, you picked up seemingly the, you know, the biggest catch drive of the year, it looks like. And you've, you know, been able to assess some pretty good talent over the years, including this guy's grandfather. Maybe just talk about the level of talent this guy possesses. Well, I think his... Uh He's just got so much more to go. I mean, I just barely scratched the surface here tonight. He, uh, there was so much left in the tank, and he just does it so easy, and uh, he's got a great future. Just tell me about how he responded when uh, Drury came at you with the other undefeated Colt. Yeah, he's, he's not really aggressive. He's on the lines, but he's just not really aggressive, and that horse came up on him, and then he just heard him at the last minute and picked it up, and away he went. I mean, he just, he just does what he has to, and I just asked him to pace at the top of the stretch, and... He did the rest. Nice job, Paul. Thank you. 
All right, Tony, let's uh, bring this guy in. It's got to be pretty special to you. I mean, you know the family. You know the dam is on the Art Speak side. Of course, Captain Treachery's he campaigned him. And, you know, just to get uh, his crop here, I mean, you got to be so proud, like, like a proud papa, how good they're doing. Yeah, absolutely. You know, we started with 18 Captain Treacherous's. 17 are racing and uh, I think 12 of them have already won and taken marks so you know we're very proud of what he's done so far and I trained the mayor Aquavella and she was meant to be a great mayor got hurt early and uh, she was responsible for art speak because I went back and bought art speak yeah. because I like the mayor so much. What, and, and I mean, the bloodlines is why you like this guy too? Yeah, she was a train in the mayor, know what kind of ability she had, and she got hurt. She never got to live up to her potential. So, you know, when we saw this Colt being by captain, I mean, it was a no-brainer. Were you sitting there confident that he was going to be able to step away from from these Colts when they came at him? Well, you know, if he's the kind of horse we thought he was, uh, then he's supposed to be able to do what he did tonight. You know, he did it uh, right off the bat of the Meadowlands. Uh, they trained him out of here on Thursday in 59. He was very sharp. He warmed up good tonight, so I felt good going into the race. Metro is obviously the main goal for him uh, in the near future. Do you prep him with the Nassau Way and the Champlain? Uh, most likely the Nassau Way to see how he comes out of this and play it. But uh, the, what I really like about this colt, you know, I haven't seen him in two weeks since I was up here last time, is the horse has actually put on weight every start. So, you know, that's such a positive sign this time of year for a two-year-old. You know, the more we throw at him, the better he gets. So, you know, we're pretty excited. I know you were telling me earlier you're really high on this guy. He's one of your best. You were talking about Major Deception, another son of Captain Treacherous. Will we also see him here? Uh, we haven't decided yet. We're going to race him Saturday in Lexington, the Kentucky Sire Stakes. He won uh, uh, on Saturday in Lexington. He paced the back cabin 53-2, and two, come according 25 and change to win down there in an overnight. So depending on how he races Saturday in the Kentucky Sire's first leg, then we'll make a decision based on that. Well done, Tony. Thank you. All right, Tony Alanya, Paul McDonnell team up for a slew of owners that are be awfully happy here with this undefeated cool Captain Ahab.